friends, I'm Grishma and you are watching my channel G Tutorial. Today's video is on Railway NDPC Recruitment 2019. I will share with you all relevant details related to the notification recently published by Railway Recruitment Board. Uh, it is mainly invited for four main posts. NDPC non-technical popular categories, paramedical staff, ministerial and isolated categories and also for 11-1 post. And for these three posts, almost 30,000 vacancies is notified. And for level 1 post, almost 1 lakh vacancies is notified. Uh, we will be mainly focusing on NDPC exam. And classes will be uh, soon started. Within 2 weeks, classes will be started for the NDPC. Please, so please stay tuned to my channel for getting uh, the NDPC classes. And uh, NDPC is, uh, is for any graduates. Any graduates... Uh, BCOM, BSc or BTEC graduates, anyone, uh, BCA, anybody can apply for the post of NDPC uh, and uh, the following posts are belonging to this NDPC category. Account and Capitalist Pist, Commercial Apprentice, Commercial Complicate Clerk, Goods Guard, Junior Clerk Come Typist as well as Senior Clerk Come Typist, Station Master, Traffic Assistant. And also uh, the following notification like paramedical staff, uh, the posts are ECG technician, health and material inspector, uh, lab assistant, lab superintendent, pharmacist, staff nurse. And in the case of ministerial and isolated categories, chief law assistant, junior translator, stenographer. These posts belong to this category. And finally, the level 1 post, assistant and helper in various technical departments belong to level 1 post. And the uh, NDPC category, we are able to apply uh, from March 1st, that is tomorrow. And uh, for paramedical staff from March 4th and uh, ministerial, this is active from March 8th. And finally, level 1 post is from March 12th. And also, uh, you can apply online through the site uh, uh, from which RRB you are uh, going to apply, you can enter the site of the RRB. For example, I am from Kerala and I will be applying from RRB Thiruvathur. Like that, you can enter the site of the RRB from which uh, from which you belong. So, uh, you can enter the site and uh, complete the registration process by uh, typing your name, then uh, your uh, father's name, mother's name, your Aadhaar card number, uh, your email ID, mobile number, then uh, some other details etc and after completing the registration process you can fill the application form uh, then upload your photo and signature and also you can do the payment process now we can see uh, the age limit uh, for this uh, for NDPC the age limit uh, most probably the age limit will be from 18 to 32 it is not uh, the detailed notification is not yet published, so we can uh, as per the uh, earlier exams, the age limit was from 18 to 32. So we can hope it will be the same for this year also. Action procedure involves the following uh, stages. First will be the preliminary test, then the main test and finally the document verification. And the pre preliminary test uh, contains the following sections. Mathematics 20 marks from mathematics section, mental ability and reasoning 25 marks and general science 25 marks and finally general awareness 30 marks. I think those who have prepared for uh, railway group D exam as well as law co-pilot or uh, those who are preparing, still preparing for RB J exam can easily crack this exam as the uh, for the initial stage is same you are uh, the, uh, the syllabus is same for uh, NDPC also and also those who are not yet applied for any of the uh, the posts I have mentioned before you can apply for NDPC and uh, from today onwards you can start preparing so uh, you may be able to uh, crack the exam very well now we can see the application fees. Application fees is for males, it is 500 rupees, and uh, for females and SCST, and as well as acceleration, the fees is 250. These fees are refundable, that is, we, after uh, the examination, uh, we will be refunded this. So uh, you can visit the site of IndianRailways.gov.in 
and you can apply from the RRB to which you belong or uh, you can ap apply to an RRB you wish to apply that is uh, you can check the detailed notification that will be published soon and uh, you can see the vacancy details and you can apply to the RRB where there is more vacancy hope you are clear with all the uh, details related to the notification so please tune to uh, the Indian Railway site uh, so that you get, you get the detailed notification and please all uh, apply on time and don't wait for uh, the last date the last date is not yet published so please everybody apply uh, on time and study from today onwards uh, you know the syllabus this is the syllabus and uh, it will be better from studying uh, on a daily basis if you are having any doubts you can comment below thank you